Hello everyone. So I've been struggling a little. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to Scotland. Uh, my doctor said yes, I can go. And uh, I have a video for Tuesday and the video that I did for Tuesday just took so freaking long to make. So um, I don't have a video for Friday or I didn't and I was kind of panicking because I've got some videos that are like half done or three quarters done but like nothing that I could kind of wrap up and still have time to pack because I'm leaving tomorrow. And then a package came! Yay! From C1A and I thought we'd open that up together and I, I kind of peeked um, and saw that uh, there were some ink samples and so I thought Maybe I'll use one of those ink samples on this Mr. Pin and ink that up and take that with me because I'm trying to figure out, I don't want to take like, you know, my sailors or anything I could lose because I think I've told you guys 1,000 times that I lose things easily and I don't want to. So I'm taking like my Twisby Mini and then something else in the bargain kind of base. But I, I've got, the only things I've got inked up are my Banu my um I still think I take a traveler's company but the only things I've got inked up are my bay news and my sailors yeah um I do I mean there's a little bit of ink in this but I was just kind of hoping to finish it I don't know I don't know what I'm doing so what I might do <laughs> I don't know yet because I haven't looked at what the inks are is I might ink this up and take it with me because it kind of has a interesting nib and that way I can practice with it because it's this is the one that has the left italic somehow I lost the sticky note that said what this was I will put it on the screen after I ask my friend what I got because <laughs> she's the one who gave it to me actually I pre I filmed a bit of a video I think that oh my uh, London fountain pen meetup video that has it so I'll just watch that find out what this pin is this is what it's like right now. I'm, I'm full chaos. Um, if you could see behind me, <laughs> I'm trying to pack, but I've ripped apart my entire room. Okay. So I've got a postcard sending memory on paper. That is so cute. And we've got a washi tape. Oh, I, I saw her open this from her San Francisco pin show hall. Oh, I love it. Look, it's got little houses. I have a thing about houses. Um, Simone on her Kofi has got a um, house dates. And I use it all the time in my journal. Because, <laughs> you know, there's just days where you want to be home or you want to stay home. And so just using the home date sticker. Let me grab my journal and I'll show you. Because I'm, I'm all about side quests today. <laughs> so we'll do that side quest real quick. So yeah, in her, in the description of her videos, where's the last house I used? So if I was thinking, I would have found one of these before. There's one. See the little house? It has the date. I need to print these out bigger, actually. But I thought I was going to want to write a lot. I used another one recently. Hmm. There's one. See? They're so cute. So, go to her Kofi. Download some houses. Print them out on sticker paper. Okay, so I got a... So I was supposed to go to the San Francisco Pen Show um, and meet up with her. 
and so she sent me these things because I didn't get to make it which is so amazing and look I've got a rickshaw thing the pin sleeve oh it's orange on the inside look at that orange oh, excellent I love it look it's a fountain pen and then I've got I've got the sticker. Guys, I have the sticker. The sticker, I think. I do! The Pincho sticker that she was handing out. Yay! I have one too. And then a, a bunch of things in here. I just all the stuff. I always use these in my journal as well as little pockets. Oh, I've got a few of the stickers I could share. Ticket. Los Angeles. New pin date. Oh, that's great. This is cool. It's like a cafe or something. Oh, San Francisco Pin Show sticker. San Francisco Pin Show rickshaw bag sticker. Oh, wow. Simone, you were like really spoiled me. Look at all these stickers. These are great. PET tape. Is it pet tape or PET tape? I don't know. Break time. Tomato drink. Have a nice weekend. <laughs> Orange dark chocolate. Oh, that's pretty. Flowers. Sugar Turtle Studio. There's like a pelican. Or pelican, I think I was supposed to say. Flakes. That's upside down. Next stop, Cream City. Good time. With an umbrella. God, I wish it would rain. It's so muggy here. The weather app is totally lying to me. It's like, oh yeah, there's only 39% humidity. There's no way. We were all dying today. <laughs> it's only in the 80s, like Fahrenheit wise. It was uh, 30 Celsius, so it shouldn't have been, we, we shouldn't have been suffering that much. Oh, these are cute. Did you, did you stamp these? These look stamped. I think these were stamped. Oh, so cool. There's the San Francisco Bridge. Change this lucky fortune for a free sticker at Rickshaw's table. Alright, what else? What else we got? We got more stickers. Turtle. Hello, Tello. Oh, I was. Uh, I followed them on Instagram. They had some really pretty pins. I would have to kind of try and write with that pin, though, because it's like the nib just goes straight off the. Like, there's no kind of section. It's like just. You know, pin, and then the nib sticks out at the end. Um, go look them up on Instagram to see what I'm talking about. What is this? What is this? It's a insert. Like a field notes kind of size, it looks like. Lined, which is good. I can use that to write letters. I have a pen pal. I haven't heard from her in a while, but we used to kind of do these kinds of notebooks, send each other notebooks. Hopefully she is okay. All right, to the inks. Oh wait, I didn't open this one. This is PET -P or pet tape. <laughs> I think it's PET. I'm not gonna be able to open this. On camera, or am I? I am. Oh! I saw her open this as well. So cute. I need a new cat. That's what I need. I need to dye my hair blue again and I need a new cat. These are things that must happen in my life. I used to have a kind of teal colored hair for like a long time. And then I, um, and then it was kind of like a periwinkle color, bluey lavender. And then I just let it go gray. 
And I think I, I don't know. I think I might be bored with that. We shall see. Look at all this. Wow. This is great because I'm so behind in my journaling. <laughs> I'm a little bit catch up because, wow. And then I'll read this later. My pin is going on one of my bags. And then let's see. What do we got? We've got oh, Birmingham and Pelican Edelstein Appetite. As y'all know, Birmingham won't send things to us in the UK. It's really hard to get a hold of anything Birmingham Pin Company. Okay, so we've got cold still. I'm just going to do these on these today. I'm not going to do them in the tomorrow because I ain't got time. <laughs> I'm desperate to put up a video for Friday. And so it's just going to be kind of a minimalist video. So this is Birmingham Coal... Birmingham Pin Company Cold Steel. Which looks like a bluey gray. It's kind of like a, I think what they'd call a blue black. Yeah, I don't even have like a design for Birmingham Pen Company because <laughs> I just, you know, to do the Tomoe River thing, I have to find. I went to a craft show yesterday, walked around for like two and a half hours and did not see any kind of stencils or stamps that would work for the kind of symbols. It was all really overly detailed stuff. But I mean, it was actually a big pin show. It was at an airport. Uh, exhibition center or something and like Windsor and Newton was there and Posca pins were there and it was you know a for reals craft show and I've been to some really not for reals ones um what what do I do next where's my thing oh here it is <laughs> okay I usually write it in regular pen but I'm gonna write it in this because don't care. <laughs> Birmingham. Um, pin co. Another eye. Yes, this stays on the nib really nicely. I've realized that if the ink sticks kind of on that glass nib, then I really end up liking the ink. So this, this is nice. All right. There's my cloth. I don't know, are my hands still a mess? <laughs> I have to refill my sketch pen with carbon black. And I got it everywhere. So I'm going to try to sketch something, guys, with one eyeball. Let's see how that goes. Woo! Oh, this is pretty. This is really nice. So this is appetite. I have, I have a ton of beads because I used to make jewelry. Have some of this. I don't think I've got any necklaces made with it right now. No, I don't. All those are sold. Uh, mm -mm. It's pretty. If that nib was like extra fine, <laughs> I would do that. All right. So I'm not sure. Hmm. Maybe I can ink up. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to ink up a Jinhao 82, I think. And bring that with me. And that way, if I lose it, I will not cry. Because we don't want me to cry, do we? I'm opening the wrong drawer.
Coop. I'm opening the wrong pin case. This video is going well. All right, which one should it go in? Hmm. to do it. Let's just put it in this one because it doesn't go at all. But I don't care. I need to bring a pin. And I'm going to try to use this food in it. Now, do I want this? Let's do the Birmingham because we just got to do the Birmingham because I want just to get my hands on the Birmingham. Actually, yeah, we'll just do this one, whatever. So after I put this one together, I realized I had kind of like backwards copied the home pin from Yoseka. Like, I think that was my color inspiration without even realizing it. I mean, it's put together differently, but it's got the clear and the kind of nudie color. So, whoops. Obviously, no comparison. See me not know how to use this in action. Where's all right? Jinhao, it is your food day. And then we'll do this way. See? Isn't that cool? I'm just writing with it upside down. It's super smooth. And so if I write with this at a higher angle... Then it's like a medium. So if I want to do a title, like... Okay, yes, perfect. Best decision. <laughs> I can't get it in. <laughs> okay. Uh, fantastic. I have a video for Friday. This is so barely going to be edited. Um, thank you, Simone. I am so happy. Like, this got me a video, and I'm trying a Birmingham ink, and you, you kind of saved my butt here, and I'm going to put it in this pen case if I can hold on to things. It's kind of sad putting a gin out in one of these nice rickshaw cases, but that's what's happening. Um, all right, that is it. Thank you very much. Bye. I'm back. I think I decided I'm going to put a split in here because I've got it out. Why not? And I'll bring these two. And I'll just have some really chunky nibs going on. No idea how far I put that down in there. <laughs> I couldn't see. All right. Okay, Mr. Pin. Let's see what this nib is like. So I know I said I was going to do a review on this pin. Maybe I'll do it after I've used it for a while. Because as it stands right now, 
That's not happening. Okay. So this was a fine cursive. Can I write small enough to fit in my Hobonichi grid? Do it. Look. All right. So I'll bring that pin too. And I'll leave the Twisby here because the Twisby's filled with her old gray. And that's kind and not too far off this color in a way, especially if I'm writing extra fine. Nice. Okay, where to put the lid? Here. All right. That's it. That's what's going. Thank you. Bye.